Oh, great. You're back. What do you want? I managed to stop the rebellion. The mutants should resume work soon. Well, there's a bit of good news. Sure it wouldn't have ended so well without your help. I would have lost my job, so thank you. Officer! Officer! I need to talk to you! I'm... I'm sorry to bother you, officer, but I have... important information about the Vori and their... illegal activities. What kind of information? It's... I worked for the mom. For months, I was put in charge of laundering the serum, but I, I can't do it anymore. The pressure put on me, the fear of getting caught. So I have decided to tell the authorities anything they may want to know about the Vori's operations. Give them any evidence they need. But I'm scared, officer, for my life. I just need an escort to see the investigators. Can you help me out? Let me think about it. Of course, sure. I need time to grab some documents the investigators will want to see. In the meantime, I'll just pray you'll agree to pick me up tomorrow.
Hey there, Fiorello. Ah, the one, the only, Zachariah Manser. A pleasure as always. What brings you here this fine day? You already back, Lieutenant Zachariah? Mutants are back to work, Captain. Well done, Lieutenant. Now go see Ryan and get paid. I warned you to keep your head down, Lieutenant. Don't know what you did, but Colonel Victor was having you tailed during your missions. And now, he's got a shitload to say about it. And none of it's good. I tried defending you, but the things he's saying... According to the Colonel, the level of violence you're bringing is... ...making it difficult for the mutants to accomplish their repair work. I know it sounds absurd to reason with them instead, but we need them, and your tactics are slowing our progress. I'm not there to be diplomatic, Captain. I'm there for a mission, which I accomplished, because the tough approach is all the mutants here. Maybe the fault's ours. Forgetting Technomancers aren't magicians. You can't work miracles. And if force produces results, minor delays are better than the rebellion we were otherwise facing. Victor also states you voluntarily jeopardized the lives of the officials you were charged with protecting. Wanna explain that? How do I explain something that's not? If I put those officials' lives in more danger, I'd have been risking my men's lives and mine as well. Why would I do that? And the claims that you've been hiding vital intel for the sole benefit of your fellow Technomancers. Like an important research site on the Shadow Path of Aurora that didn't even register a line item in your reports? My mission, Captain, as I understood it, was to destroy tunnels and fight Aurora. Yes, I came across an archaeological site on the Shadow Path, but it had nothing to do with my mission. So I saw no need to put it in my report. If that was a judgment error, I'll own it. But it was an error. Nothing more. As a Technomancer, I'm surprised you don't understand the potential value of sites like that. Knowing such excavations can turn up relics dating back to the colonization. But I won't hold your ignorance against you. It was a mistake. A simple omission. That can be forgiven. At least by me. And the list of accusations and the details is long. Poured on the deserters. Less truth than lies. Almost more lies than ink. Never would have expected it from you, Lieutenant. You gonna blame the Colonel for the fact that Bulgakov never claimed to? Captain, before we go any further, I'm gonna admit I haven't been fully honest in my mission reports. Wrote things to put myself in the best light, rather than take full responsibility for my mistakes. It was stupid and disrespectful to you. But I never meant it like that, I assure you. Mistakes are one thing, Lieutenant. No soldier is perfect. Lies, though? Lies are another. You tried to protect your reputation with them, and instead, destroyed it. Maybe beyond repair. Quite a goddamn irony, isn't it? Well done. Unfortunately, he's already called you in, and I can't stop it. All I can tell you is watch your mouth. Behave like the soldier you've been since you joined my company, and you'll come out just fine. 
I'll plead in your favor if it comes down to that. Let's just hope it doesn't. Get going. Colonel's waiting. Good luck. Hi. Lieutenant. Help you. Captain Eliza told me to find you for my pay. Indeed, I've been expecting you. Zachariah, I was scared we were too late. For what? What's going on? There's no time to talk. You're in danger. Victor called you in, didn't he? Yeah, wants to talk to me about... No, he doesn't. Trap. It's just an excuse to get you there. They will do whatever necessary to make you... I don't know what you technomancers are hiding, but he's ready to do anything to find out. He's got power, but he was... Zach, Merle, you stay away from that man. The crook of the pig! Thanks, Scott. Listen to us, Zachariah. I know it's hard to hear. If you stay here, you're going Where would I even... We take a rover and go. Sounds filled with ASC looking now, but I know a road that must avoid most of the troops. Let's go, Zach. 